Coaches come and go for all sorts of reasons, but then there are coaches who are there and seems to no one can figure out why. Thomas, what coach has no place being in this current role? Oh man, Alvin Gentry. Out of New Orleans, the New Orleans Pelicans coach, Alvin Gentry. This guy's been coaching since 1994. He coached for Miami, Detroit, the LA Clippers. Well, he has a, a re resume there. Okay, you wanna hear more about it? Okay, so go for it. So in all those years, in 20 years, he's won over 50 games once. He's made the playoffs <laughs> twice, only made it to the conference finals with the Phoenix Suns in 09. And ever since then, He's just been uh, stinking it up a storm. Uh, he took a two-year break, didn't have any work, and then in 2015, New Orleans, for some reason, was like, hey, that's our guy. Why do you think that they're keeping him, then? Um, I have no clue. So you and that's think why that he's, he's my candidate ended. for why he should not be coach anymore. Well, <laughs> How about okay. You? I'm going with Mike Tomlin of the Pittsburgh Steelers. Ooh. The Steelers are a good team, but they just haven't seemed to progress and make that huge jump that they need to. Yeah. And this coach, I think, is holding them back. They haven't won a Super Bowl since 2008. They just really seem to be struggling. And when they get to that point, and I will tell you that I think that coaches have a huge huge impact on a team and we've seen that over and over again mm -hmm. a team can be struggling our own elon phoenix we yeah. have a new coach and we're on fire Look at us. and i do want to say that i don't feel that i have any credentials in saying that someone should not be a coach Absolutely. because i could not do that role fun little segment though but it's very fun and <laughs> i think that maybe the steelers will transition and get someone new maybe yeah. the pelicans will too so hopefully hopefully that these will be more that these teams will increase um Maybe they're winning for San Andreas yeah. Super Bowl for Hopefully. the Steelers. Good luck to them. <laughs> <laughs> they got some iffy coaches. Just yes. <laughs> Well, that is all the time we have for this episode of 101 Sports. Special thanks to all of our producers, crew, and talent, and you, the viewer, for tuning in. If you missed anything or want to see more, check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and like our page, all at 101 Sports. Here from everyone, I want to thank you for watching, and until next time. Whose side are you on? Paper, paper, paper.